Welcome to Classical Grooming. Today we're going to take a look at a modern fragrance, Karl, Karl Lagerfeld's Bois de Vetiver. One of the reasons I like this fragrance, as, as you know, I tend to like aldehydic fragrances, something, uh, something that really has a bite toward the top. I, I like something that has deep musky bites toward the bottom, but when it comes for the warmer months, Bois de Vetiver shines. So let's go ahead and check on the notes. For the notes, we have blood orange, pink grapefruit, mint, vetiver, rose, geranium on the middle, and the base notes are ambroxan, musk, and patchouli. And for me, what really shines is the blood orange, the citrus notes, which do tend to linger for a bit longer than expected for top notes. Now, most people's beef with bois de vetiver is that it doesn't last very long it's, and it doesn't project very loudly. And I think that's why it really shines in the, sh in the summer because that's where you get a lot, a lot louder projection and you get it to really last longer and really be out there for a few hours um, because the hotter it gets, the more it projects. And so I would consider this a summertime fragrance and only a summertime fragrance because unless you're willing to overspray, uh, it's just not gonna be around for much. Uh, I mean, it'll be there throughout the day, but only if you like stick your nose up to, some, up to it to take a, take a whiff. Uh, I find that it does last longer on clothes, so that's a plus. And it, I would describe it as a floral and uh, citrus burst to my nose. Everybody's gonna be different. I'm, I'm kind of splitting the difference. I think it's a four in the summer and maybe a three or a two in fall, winter, spring because it, there's just not enough heat to project in my situation, on my skin, chemistry, to my nose, etc. So Bois de Vetiver, it is uh, kind of a secret summertime gem as far as I'm concerned. It's not expensive. I think you can pick it up for like 22, 25 bucks and it's a 3.3 liter bottle so it's gonna last you a long time. It's not my favorite summertime fragrance but I like to use it once or twice a week kind of to break up my uh, signature scents that I like to wear. Thank you very much for stopping by. Again if you like classical uh, products or reviews of modern products through a classical lens please subscribe.